Hey, what's up guys? Um, got some news. I um, recently decided that my road bike, my um, upper bike, was just giving me too much pain and as many miles as I've ridden it, it's just hard on my back and my getting, getting to my hands and uh, everything else. So I decided to switch to a recumbent. Um, this is going to be a Sun Trike. This is the lower end of the trike, the recumbent bikes out there. Now, I thought, initially thought it was a cat trike, but I was told it was a Sun Trike. And it, you even have the logo right there if you can see it. Sorry for the poor low lighting. I don't have a lot of light in this apartment. So here it is. Um, I've had it for a week now. It, I like it a lot. The only things I wish were better on it is um, bigger wheels because if you slip down here, the wheels aren't. They're only 20 inch wheels. And the bad part about that is it's got the disc brakes. And the thing with the disc brakes is they're very. They're very, very squiggle. The back, the right brakes is having an issue. I'm not going to really show you because i got the parking brake on right now. But um, the, I find myself using the front brake more often because it's smoother and every time you apply the brake, it, it steers to the right and you got to kind of counteract it a little bit and make it, steer to the, make it steer to the right so it doesn't jerk all over the place. But um, yeah, just got this last week. Um, it's a $1,300 bike and I'm making finishing up the payments on it right now. And I hope to have it paid off by the end of October. So, I like the uh, fact that it's got a nice basket in it. And uh, I can show you my tail lights real quick. Just decided to rig up two old tail lights I haven't used in a while. It's on flashing mode. Oh, oh. Yep, I'm on now. There we go. These really shine at dark. So, oh. What's going on with this damn light? Come on. Um, that's that. I have a headlight there here. As you can see, it's very, very bright. Which is definitely a plus because it sits so much lower to the ground. You can actually light up the street a little better. And I rigged a mirror on this. Hopefully it'll work out good. You might be able to see, I might be able to see the track and cool. Hopefully. I can, I can adjust it a little bit. Move it up and down if I need to. But, um, yep. Um, the only thing about it I don't like is it doesn't ride that great, but, you know, for a recumbent, it rides, you know, decent on a 1 to 10 scale, maybe a 4 or 5. It's about average. I also put two bags in the back for extra storage. Just to make myself just a little bit wider. I also got a flag, but. For some odd reason, a flag just decided to blow off into the wind, and God knows where it's at. So I just cut off a piece of my old vest I don't use no more, and just use that as a flag. Call it my makeshift flag. <laughs> so um, this zip is 24 speed. Uh, I think it's SRAM. Yeah, that's the. Uh... Yep. Yeah, sorry, I wasn't in, quite in focus there. All right, SRAM 3.0, and I'm not sure what's in the front. I really don't know, but overall, I like it. It's really nice. Um, only other issue I'm having is this the shifter. If you look here, I'm not sure what happened because this cable is supposed to go. There's a bracket that was missing there, and for some reason, this doesn't work. So I had a friend fix the chain and put it back up on the second ring. I'll get a little more speed going because when I was when I was in a small ring, I was only able to top out at 12, 13 miles an hour. Now I can top out at 20, 21. Average around 15 or so with it now. So, well, there you go. This is, would be my Sun Trike 2011 Sun Trike recumbent bicycle.